available the Word of God um, as widely as we can. I can tell you, Roger, of the 120 languages that we have, we invest more resources in our Arabic ministry. Now, not all Muslims speak Arabic. There are Farsi-speaking Muslims in Iran. There are uh, Bahasa Indonesian-speaking Muslims in Indonesia. But we put a huge amount uh, in, in all of those areas, actually. But uh, Arabic is, is really important. Um, and, y- you know, Roger, uh, missionary experts tell us that more Muslims have come to Christ in, in recent years than in the history of the world. There, yeah, there is an unprecedented openness, and media is the ideal way to reach Muslims. Another, uh, another fact I've heard is that most Muslims are coming to Christ through two primary means. One is dreams and visions. Now, I know, you know some people are very uncomfortable when you start talking about that, but I have met some of these people, and they're solid believers, and, uh, you know, they tell me they, they met Jesus in a dream. But the second way is media. And you say, well, why is that? Well, one reason is, if, if you're in a place where it's very dangerous to be a Muslim, um, think about, uh, you know, your family's going to persecute you. The media is very private, and you can, you can consume it. Um, I have, uh, do we have time for yeah. me to read a letter? Oh, one letter from our Middle East Arabic radio program. Your broadcast is one of a kind. From where I live, Christianity is vague, and we do not have literature or books about it. Since my childhood, I liked Isa Christ. Isa is the uh, word for Jesus in the Quran. But because no one could help me know him, I tried to seek different means and ways. But then I found your program that talks about the truth that Isa taught. I've always wanted to have a holy Bible, but I couldn't find it in my country because it is forbidden. I was finally able to download it as a phone app. Mm. Yay, technology. Yes, yes. And now I can read it all the time. But I couldn't have loved the Bible if not for your radio program. It is helping me to understand Isa and his gift. Through the Bible is like a door to light for me with all the teachings and explanations. I feel happy and not wanting each episode to end because it is like treasure. Many of those who are around me are listeners too, but they are hesitant to write because of the security issue. Thank you, thank you so much, and keep it up. Isn't that wow. beautiful? That is, uh, it's gorgeous to hear, and I, I, you mentioned the technology on another conversation. Yeah. We're going to yeah. have to talk about yeah. this technology, because I know you brought some gadgets here in the studio, but I, I realize that, that that's the way, I mean, that, and we think about the partnerships that Through the Bible has internationally, mm-hmm. the fact that there are apps that you're using different languages, radio, television, internet, I mean, every, every means possible, yes. taking the whole 